Okay, hello, and welcome to the episode four. Yes, I had to <laughs> episode four. I had to double check. I was um, yeah, it's definitely episode four. Yeah, yeah, yeah. One, two, three, four. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah it's fine. If I'm wrong, you know, just whatever. So we're going to be doing um, ooh, yeah, we have to actually choose now. Lucas or Carla? Lucas or Carla? Lucas or Carla? Nicky or Pam? Nicky or Pam? It's like phone booth all over again. Anyway, I think we're going to do Lucas because, you know, I like I like Lucas Kane. He's quite fun. And it's the park scene, so I can be a complete cunt if I choose to. Sorry for the language. Not really. Let's go. When Marcus and I were kids, we were inseparable. Hmm. He's yeah. He's the one who took care of me after our parents died. Moving around a Christmas tree. Dun, 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 dun. Look at the snow. Look at the statue. Look at the bird. Look at the priest. That is a priest. Yes, look at the priest. That is, you got, can tell he's got the uh, finger on his neck. Look at my feet. Look at my hands. Look at the kids. In a, in a non pedophilic way. Is he dead? Mm, looks homeless. Yeah, he looks homeless, but is he dead? He's, freezing cold. he's not. He's not. He doesn't look like he's breathing or doing anything. He's just sort of sitting there. What, what the fuck is he doing? That's not normal, man. He's probably dead. Oh, snowman! I want to play with the snowman. Oh, come on, David Cage. Let me play with the snowman. Don't be such a bastard. David Cage being the creator of the game, he's he's refusing to let me play with snowmen. That's not nice. Why is there kids everywhere? Oh, birdie, come on, birdie! No, you don't run away. I want to be your friend. Oh, I have no friends. It rings true for me as well. It's kind of like me. This is basically me in the real world, in a virtual world. And eh, more birds! Come on, birdie! Come on! I was gonna name you Magpie. And tulip, but I can't know. Tulip being spelt with C H U L I P, not T U L I P, like uh, you would think. But yeah, tulip, you know, it kind of sounds better. Oh, yeah, statue. I suppose I gotta talk to it. Oh, you can wait. Come on, guys, let's play snow. Let's play some snow games. Let's play, guys. Let's play. Oh, when you play. I'm basically Michael Jackson in the body of Lucas Kane. All right, let's um, talk to my Hi, brother, nice Marcus. It's been a while. Two years. So tell me what's happened, Lucas. I've killed a man, Marcus. I've killed a man, and it was terrible. But I couldn't help myself. I then rolled around in, in my own blood. I saw what I was doing, but I was powerless to stop it. My God. I can't believe this, Lucas. Tell me that it wasn't you. You're not capable of something like this. Well, he was pretty capable. He actually did it, so... Details? Let's look at the details. This murder? Exactly how did it happen? I get confused by this bit, because I'm not sure if it's Marcus that's asking the questions, or... Lucas, that's asking the questions. Like it prompts you to select like a selection of questions, like a you know, uh, questions that you have to select for the you know progress of the game. So you've got things like at the moment alone in wrists. So I say wrists, and it's now now I'm talking, but then it will go to another subject in a minute where I have to answer a question and it's coming from Marcus. So I get a little bit confused by that, but you know, that's my only thing. If I say drugs now, Had you been drinking or taking drugs? see, no, Marcus is saying it, not Lucas, which you know, it's kind of back and forth. But yeah, anyway. You say you were in a sort of trance. What do you mean by that? You're talking about magic or sorcery or something like that? Marcus, I don't have an explanation. I'm just telling you what happened. That's all. I'm only certain about one thing. I'm not the one who really killed that man. But you are. You you, you stood over his body and you killed him. I mean, okay, maybe you weren't in the right state of mind, but you still did it, Lucas. For fuck's sake. Rather, someone, somebody else there with you? No, it was it was like a sort of vision. I saw. Oh, another vision. Yes, it's definitely what it was. And and there was this little girl.
What about the little girl? The little girl? She seemed alone, lost. She, she asked me to help her. What happened to me, Marcus? What am I supposed to do now? You know me better than anyone, Marcus. Help me. Listen, Lucas, I... I'm a bit lost here. This whole story is just so bizarre. Hmm, maybe you're sick. In the head. Maybe you need some professional help. Most cases of possession are known to actually stem from psychiatric problems and... Okay, be aggressive. What are you saying? That I'm crazy? Is that it? I come to you as my brother for help, and that's the best you can do? I am a priest, Lucas. The fact that you have taken a life... You call yourself a, a priest. Serious matter. <laughs> I told you that it wasn't me, Marcus. All these years and nothing's changed. You still never listen to me. Lucas, don't ask me to make a choice between my faith and my brother. Somebody used me to commit a crime, and I'm going to find out what happened and why. Yeah, Whatever the cost. you tell him, Lucas. I'm sorry, Marcus. I shouldn't have come to see you. Here. You need this more than I do. Marcus, you know that I don't believe in all that. I'm an atheist, motherfucker. A lot more than a crucifix to get me out of this. Bye. Oh shit, more is going on. That kid, he's gonna drown. That kid, he's gonna slip on the ice. I've gotta stop him. The cop in the restaurant. Damn, what am I gonna do? If I don't do something, the child am I gonna let him live? Am I gonna let him die? Am I gonna get complete? Oh no. What am I gonna do? Well. I could save him, but I don't want to. Where are the police coming from anyway? Which direction? Oh, over there. Yeah, I'm just gonna go home. I think. I don't. I don't. Yeah. He can. It doesn't matter. He can. Oh. Fuck. <laughs> That's the first time it's ever happened to me. Okay. <laughs> All right. Okay. All right. Fine. Continue from last save. That's never happened to me before. I don't. I guess I've always saved a kid. I've never. Uh... Can I just can I just run away the opposite direction then? Maybe I could oh yeah, I can. Okay, so yeah, I'm, yeah. Note to self: never go the opposite direction. Okay. Are oh, you just let him die, Lucas? It's fine. To save him means I'm still free to try and find out what happened to me. Days gone by since then that I haven't regretted that choice. <laughs> That's the end of my story. <laughs> I suppose For fuck's sake. Okay, I so I basically yeah because I decided to give myself up to the police. I'll finish the rest of my days in prison. Ah. Oh. I'll never know what happened in the restaurant. Well, that's stupid. I'm just a murderer. Okay, so because I didn't save the kid, my my uh, you know my. I guess the the state of mind bar, mentality bar, whatever the fuck you want to call it, the mood bar, went down to zero, and I think that caused me to turn myself in. Okay, so I'm going to have to save the kid, you know, save the cheerleader, save the world to do this. All right, fine. Fucking kids. Making me swim in the cold for you. Who do you think you are? Are you sure there's somebody down there? Yeah, positive. I saw a kid fall in, and then a guy dove in to save <laughs> The, yeah, what? It was a little while ago. He definitely should oh, for fuck's sake. <laughs> okay, so I've killed myself now. Brilliant. Uh, yeah, I didn't hit the two I left and... Frozen waters of Central Park, trying to save the life of a young boy. Well, at least he died in a good way, you know. Fuck, you know. Alright, let's do this again. <laughs> Fuck me. Okay. Fuck, you know. This kid better be worth it. I mean... It, I already know he's not worth it, so I've played the game, but still. Right, into the water, you go, you fucking... Ugh. There he is. Alright, okay, pick him up, that's it. Quick. I've gotta go back up. 
through the water. Take me to the danger zone. Ugh, fucking hell. Ugh. Up you go. There we go. Uh. <laughs> just get up the fucking thing. Okay, I gotta give him CPR now. Or I could just leave the body. I did a little bit of work. Alright, fine. Uh. One, One, two, two three. three. Uh. One, two, three. One, two, One, three. Two, three. Yeah, this is what every CPR hat guy has in One, his head every time two, he's doing it. Ah, uh. oh, look, I saved a life. Troll three two four. Kid just fell into the water. Send an ambulance right away. Man, what courage! The kid would have died. That guy's a hero. He dove into freezing water to save the kid. He kid knows I'm the one. Out of there without him. But he's not going to arrest me. We both knew it. It's hard to say why he didn't turn me in. Maybe he decided I was even. I had taken a life and given one back. Nothing really changed for me. No, it changed nothing. But when I left that park, I knew I could look myself in the mirror again. <laughs> okay, well, that's the end of the uh, the episode, um, obviously. Um, yeah, so I'll be back next week with the next episode, episode 5. Uh, which I'm sure you guys are really looking forward to by now. Uh, if not, you've probably tuned out by now and stopped watching. But uh, yes, anyway, until next time, bye! Love you. If you subscribe to me, I'll be your best friend. And, you know, I'll I'll do things for you, to you, if you're of the female um, gender. I'm, I'm not gay. Bye.